today on the Make Me Lab, I'll show you how to give an industrial vacuum a complete tune-up by replacing the wearable components within it, such as brushes and filters. Inside most industrial vacuums, you'll find what's known as a universal motor. Within them are wearable components known as brushes that conduct the current to the commutator to make the motor function. Periodically, these brushes need replaced to keep the motor in service. Our vacuum today is actually a clipper vac for dog grooming. Thankfully, the manufacturer makes all the spare parts available. On their website, you can order the brushes, filters, or any other components. This is generally the sign of a good industrial unit when you can actually garner spare parts. This assembly of this unit is pretty straightforward. Just remove the screws on the top and remove the foam rubber inside to gain access to the actual universal motor. Inside of this unit is really well built, really clean, I'm truly impressed. We just need to loosen off the screws holding the brush holders in place and remove our brushes. They just slide out with no force required. Comparing the two you can see that these brushes had virtually no wear on them and truly didn't need replaced, but we decided to go ahead and replace them anyway to keep this thing on a routine maintenance cycle. Installation of the brushes is easy, just slide them into place, the little locator dowel will line up and it'll set right into the cradle. Tighten the screws down and you're all set. We just have to put the foam back in place, secure the lid back on, and we're all set to test this out. I ran this in for about a half an hour to make sure we were all set and no issues with the brushes seating. The bottom of this unit has a separate air filter to stop the clippings from getting into the motor. This air filter is pretty clogged up at this stage so we went ahead and replaced it as well. Just remove the wing nut, slide it off, and replace the filter. We can probably clean out the old filter with some compressed air, but for now we'll use the new one and swap them out at a later date. Reassembly is super easy. That's all there is to it. This vacuum is ready to go back into service, hopefully for a long time to come. If you're new to the channel, remember, click that thumbs up if you like this video and check out my other videos on the channel. Subscribe as well. See you next video.